if you're familiar with Thai, the Indus entrepreneurs, it's easier for me to share about AFI's work in comparison and in contrasting it with the work of Thai. So if you know about Thai, Thai is this global platform or global network that fosters entrepreneurship and mentors entrepreneurs. Uh, Thai was set up in the, more than 25 years ago in Silicon Valley by a bunch of successful Indian American entrepreneurs. And um, it was started uh, this time ago. And over the course of the last 25 years, it's expanded to more than 60 chapters around the world in 14 countries and five continents. So Action for India has been very clearly been inspired by Thai. What Thai does for general entrepreneurs globally, Action for India does for social entrepreneurs in India. It's a similar platform for fostering social innovation, social entrepreneurship and mentoring of social entrepreneurs. We are all familiar with what uh, startups are, what who entrepreneurs are, but the movement when somebody used the phrase social enterprise, there's a little bit of confusion that sets in. And uh, most people's default assumption is that we must be talking about a not-for-profit NGO. Uh, not always, not quite. And there's no right or wrong answer about this. There are certain situations which lend themselves to not-for-profit solutions. And there are other situations which are more appropriate for market-based approaches uh, and for-profit solutions. And there is uh, unfortunately no universal consensus as to what is a social enterprise. Um, different individuals, different organizations use different definitions. And the definition that we use at Action for India goes something like this. According to us, a social enterprise is any organization that's developing products and or services that proactively by intention, not as a byproduct, make things better for those in the underserved communities and attempt to do it at scale. So the bottom of the pyramid orientation and the ambition of scale are critical elements in our definition of what is a social enterprise. And most of these social enterprises emerge from what we refer to as the social benefit sectors, the usual suspects, education, healthcare, agriculture, livelihood, FinTech, clean tech. So our core mission at Action for India is to identify the high potential social entrepreneurs of the country and then connect them with resources. It could be funding, mentors, technology resources, government decision makers, customers, and what have you, and help thereby help scale the impact of the world. So Action for India was launched more than eight years ago in 2012. And during these eight years, we've developed a few initiatives to help us fulfill the mission of the organization. 